stopping the intruder in his tracks before the crime has occurred means finding the signs of a cybercrime in motion. My job as security analyst is finding the right starting point and putting together the clues and to do it as quickly as possible. My role is to find the right clues, understand them, look at what happened next, and react appropriately. However, since 70% of high severity alerts are ultimately determined to be false positives, my best analysts and my MSSP are not investigating the most critical threats targeting our business. This means we're wasting a lot of money while our risk posture is getting worse. It also means my best analysts are being demotivated by the lack of progress. With top security analysts in high demand, keeping them engaged and productive is critical. We already face staffing shortages across our security organization. We can hardly afford to lose our top people. Wasting time and raising the red flag for a possible incident does not help my team, my bosses, or my customers. A false positive is not positive for me at all. I'm an Arbor customer and this is a real story. I was sitting down to start my day and went back to look at the previous week's activity. With Arbor Network Spectrum, I could see what was happening in every part of my network over that time. I could see immediately that a fake antivirus Atlas Intelligence Feed threat indicator was triggered for a host on my network. Arbor Spectrum is updated with new intelligence every hour from our Atlas dataset that sees attacks occurring in more than 30% of all internet traffic. So I dug in more. Within seconds, I had pivoted my view around the host and could see further suspicious activity starting just after the initial event, including some further threat indicators on port 80. I was able to drill down and see a suspicious URL being requested and content being downloaded. This told me that a program or other payload had been activated, but I don't have a malware research team that can reverse engineer binaries at my company. But I was not finished yet. With Spectrum, I was able to look at the host in more detail, and I noticed communications with a changed user agent and other unusual connections to IP addresses within my network, possibly indicating lateral movement a sure sign that the attackers were in the explore and expand phase of a highly targeted attack. Armed with the exact information, I had found the smoking gun and was able to contain the attackers before they got to the exfiltration phase. I was able to find all of this in under seven minutes. No other solution I've ever had or have seen could do this. I wouldn't have found them with my firewall, IPS, or SIM. I need to know specifically what I'm looking for to search my SIM, and my forensics tool helps me when something has already happened, not when I'm investigating something new. All good investigators rely on facts and not speculation, and Arbor Spectrum fills in the blanks and gives you the information you're really after. Arbor Networks, the security division of NetScout.